Hello everyone, this is Lime. This is video number 269. And for this video, we're going to show you how to log into um, a site called fontstruct.com. And uh, the way we're going to do it this time, and uh, we're going to sign up for it, and we're going to log in. The way we're going to do it is we're going to use a window called incognito window in Google Chrome, or I think it's called secret browsing. What is it called here? Uh, private window in uh, Mozilla Firefox. And the reason why we're doing this is because if you're having any like um, cached issues or login issues, sometimes it's because uh, your browser may be caching information um, and it's making a, an issue just logging in. So to get past that, sometimes you should just use um, this new private window or incognito window in Google Chrome. So here it gives you a little information. So in this private window, it says um, Firefox won't remember any history for this window. That includes browsing history, search history, download history, web form history, cookies, and temporary internet files. So and it says here, however, files you download and bookmarks you make will be kept. So uh, here we go. Let's log into fontstruct.com. So here we are at fontstruct. We're going to sign in. And... Uh, Let's say we don't have an account, so we're going to create an account. And uh, font. Well, I always use font news for now, since that's my channel. And uh, we'll put font news for now at linedetail.com. Oh, what am I doing? Wrong password. Okay. So I'm not a robot. Select all squares with street signs. Boom and boom and next. And more street signs. I mean, these are all parts of the street sign, right? Verify. Cool. So I'm not a robot. Sign me up. Oh, please agree. I have to agree. Okay, let me do this one more time. Sorry for the delay, everybody. Uh, but I have to be, a, be not a robot. Select all images with a storefront. Okay, it looks like a storefront, looks like a storefront. Maybe that's a storefront. Verify. Okay, cool. I hit that checkbox, hit sign up. All right. Thanks for registering, and you're only one step away from font structing. We've sent an email to font news for now at linedetail.com. Follow the simple instructions. Okay, so let's go there. There we go. We've got an email. Let's hit the button. All right. And it opened up in my other Google Chrome thing. I'm going to go back to Fontstruct here and click sign in. All right, so there's my username. Now we're going to put in my password. And my password is, uh, oh my goodness. That's not my password. I just totally forgot it for a split second. Um, and so now we're logged in. And so now we're logged in via uh, the secret window, as you can tell by the little icon in the top right corner of Firefox Mozilla. So that's that. So now we just create something new, new font structure. Name your design. News. Start font structing. And go to N, and we'll make an N. Woohoo! That's a really bad N. Then we'll go to E. All right, and then we'll go to W. I'll make a W. And we'll go to S. And we've got an S now. Let's preview it. N E W S. Boom! Look at that. It's amazing. All right, cool beans. So now I'm going to sign out, and the reason for doing so is oh, actually, hold on. Stay on the page. Save. We want to save our font that we made. We're going to sign out, and we're going to close this. And now we're going to go to uh, the incognito window of Google Chrome. So same thing here. It won't uh, save information, and we should be able to good to go. So fontstruct.com. Boom. Sign in. Okay. Now we're logged in. Go to my fontstruct. 
and we should go to our saved there it is on the bottom left there uh, news boom there we go that's great so we made our font we logged in and that's how you log in with the uh, incognito window incognito window incognito window and the secret window on Firefox I hope that helped you out and that's it for this video this is line that's news for now and I'll speak to you all tomorrow. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below. And if you have any requests for another tutorial, let me know and I'll make one for you. Okay, bye-bye.